Dude, why are you knocking? What do you mean? Mikasa is Sukasa. You never knock. Sorry, Liv. I'm kind of spaced. I like the thing you've done with your eye makeup. Thanks. I tried to make them look a little bit less dead and hollow. Unsuccessfully. I think your eyes look cute, so I complimented them. Just accept the compliment for what it is. Thank you. So what's up, Kit? Nothing much. What's up with you? Did I tell you about that guy at work? The cute one? Mm-hmm. So he's still sticking with that whole pretending to be uninterested thing. It's just like he did the other day. Wait, did I tell you about the other day? Okay, back up. Let's take it from the top. So the other day, he was just like going on and on about Dungeons and Dragons and he just, just like, just kept going. Remind me why I keep letting you do this to me again. Think of it as like a rite of passage. A rite of passage to what? Cinematic culture. Just consider it like, like exposure therapy. I'm forcing you to face your fears. I'm not afraid of clowns. I just kind of find them freaky. Mm -hmm. Just sit back and watch. Indy. Indy. India. What? No, sorry. What did you say? <sighs> Never mind what I said. What is going on with you? Come on, talk to me. Noah and I broke up a couple weeks ago, actually. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. Who pulled the trigger? Me. Then I'm sure you had a good reason. One you're obviously not ready to talk about now, so I won't push it. Thanks, Liv. Don't mention it. Hey, do you think we should have a song? A song? Yeah, you know how couples have songs, right? It's a thing. Oh, is it a thing? Yeah, I mean, if you think it's dumb, we don't have to. I don't think it's dumb. I mean, did you have a song in mind? Maybe. Well, come on, let me hear it.
Hey, excuse me. Could you help me find the self-help section? Uh, yeah, of course. Just follow me this way. Okay. It's a little awkward, isn't it? What is? Guiding someone to the self-help section. It's like I'm telling you, a total stranger, that there's something wrong with me. N no, I don't think so. I think it's kind of cool. Really? Yeah, I mean, you may have your problems, but so do the rest of us. At least you're being proactive, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I guess you're right. But, th but this is what I'm talking about. That low self-esteem. <laughs> I guess I just really need to boost my confidence. Yeah, I, I get what you mean. This should be everything. Just let me know if you need any more help, okay? Uh, great. Um, thanks. Um, yeah, just... Uh, sorry. No, you're, you're okay. Uh, right there. <laughs> thanks. Uh -huh. I just don't understand what you're talking about. Exactly! You never understand what I'm talking about! You always look at me like I don't make any sense! That's not what I'm trying to do. Yeah, right. Look, what do you want to do about this situation? Why do I always have to come up with a solution? Because you're the one with the problem, Indy. So now I'm the problem. That's not what I said. You know I didn't say that. How about since I'm the problem, why don't I just leave? I wouldn't want to cause you any more grief. Are you serious? Yeah. Has a heart attack. So I told you that Noah and I broke up, and I told you that I broke up with him, but I didn't tell you why. And to be honest, I didn't really know why until earlier today. The last time I saw Noah, I picked a fight with him. I don't really know why, I don't even know what I was upset about, but I fought him. I think it all might have just been too much, you know, like, I was waiting for him to tell me that I was too much, and that he, he couldn't handle me anymore, so I did it for him. You remember when we met? Yeah, fourth grade. We were all put in that project and no one did what they were supposed to do, including me, except for you. And instead of taking credit for the work that you did do, you took the blame for not doing enough. I remember. You've always been like that. You judge yourself so harshly. You never accept praise. You walk with your eyes on the ground, both literally and figuratively. When you told me you broke up with him, I figured that's what happened. You, you gotta stop that, you know? Like, I admire your need to always do your best, but sometimes just trying your best is enough. Sometimes just being yourself is enough. I think you're amazing. No, actually, I know you're amazing. I know it, no one knows it, but more importantly, you have to know it. Yeah, well, I got this today. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm proud of you, Indy. I'm proud of me too.
Hi.